Hi, everybody. Happy Friday. Um, hopefully you have been able to learn a lot throughout the last three days about summarizing nonfiction. Um, we did the malaria article um, together and it took us a couple days, but we walked through the four steps of um, actually, um, you know, from reading the article the whole way to writing the summary. You're going to do that today on your own. Uh, now, on the screen, you can see that I have um, the slides that you're going to see when you click on the assignment. It says practice summarizing, and then it says step one. You are to choose an article to summarize from slides two, five, or eight. So there are three articles that you can choose from, okay? The ones on the Eiffel Tower, one has to do with space, and the other one has to do with roller coasters, okay? So you get to choose which article you'd be maybe more interested in. You're going to read the entire article. Again, this is just a page page long, okay? Then step three, you're gonna reread by paragraph and you're gonna annotate and highlight as you read, just like we did in class for the malaria article. Step four then, you're gonna complete the graphic organizer slide. I'm gonna show you those here in a minute. And then step five, you're gonna write your summary on the slide. Okay, so this is the very first slide here on the PowerPoint that you are going to be opening um, that's going to be your assignment, okay? So let's take a look at the first story, okay? The first story is called What a Thrill, and it's about roller coasters or thrill rides, okay? Um, so you can see that this is broken up just like I had broken up the malaria article so that you can, um, you know, work with it the exact same way by highlighting and annotating, okay? So if you would choose this article, the absolute next slide, okay, where it says here, step three, complete the graphic organizer. This is already formatted for you as text boxes are in here, okay? So that all you have to do is go in and put your information from your story, what you annotated into the graphic organizer, okay? The third and final slide then is step four, okay, and that is to go ahead and write your summary. And the text box is also in there, so you just double tap there with your iPad and you can just go ahead and write your summary or type your summary. You also have the option, you can do it on paper if you would prefer, and then you can just submit it um, in class to me for credit, okay? So um, remember, there's another story. You don't need to do all three stories. I do not want you to do all three stories, okay? So, and actually I should say articles. These are articles. Space Travelers, okay? If you would choose that one, then you're not gonna do um, slides two, three, and four. You would start with slide five and do slide five, slide six, and slide seven, okay? And then the final article is the Eiffel Tower. And if you choose this article, then you would only be completing slides eight, slide nine, and slide 10, okay? When you are finished with the slides, you don't have to delete anything, okay? You can just go ahead and submit them through Schoology um, so that I can get your information and look at your summary and how you um, annotated your article. This should not take any longer than 30 minutes to complete, okay? So keep that in mind. This should not take you any longer than 30 minutes. Read and annotate the article, complete the graphic organizer, and then type your summary, okay? It's a very short article, all right? So uh, if you have questions, reach out to me, um, or I'm gonna see you in class on Monday, so you can come with your questions then if you um, have any, all right? I look forward to seeing you on Sunday or on Monday. Have a wonderful weekend.